Okay, hi guys, it's Annabelle from The Free Ems and it is Wedding Wednesdays as you all know and this week I am going to apply for the reality TV show, dating show called Dress to Impress. So I've got to the application stage on the website. They want my first name and my last name and of course an email address. Thank you. Oh God. TV at Gmail. And I've got to have a password apparently. The application uh, closing date is March 2021, so, so far, so good. I could do a dressing to impress. I've been in the same clothes for the last. 10 days and it's just been so confidence destroying because obviously with what's going on at my residential address So um, it says tick if you want to be con don't want to, do want to be contacted by other programs and there's an email address that you can email privacy at itv.com if you uh, want to change your mind about that. So it says by ticking this box below you can confirm that you comply with each of the eligibility requirements. You have answered all the questions in the application form honestly and truthfully and you have read and understood to agree to the terms of tish conditions. Okay. Mountains verify register. I can see so. So let me screenshot that and I'm not going to remember that. So now it's onto the application form, date of birth. And the address, my current residential address. This booth stinks a bit. Don't have a work telephone number, social media. the last time I had some employment and what would I describe uh, I'd say form fitting when I have free uh, I'd say okay form fitting Oh God, hang on a minute. Hello? Sorry about that. I just got a call from a uh, women's refuge, so I didn't really want to put all the details in there with regards to the problem. Right, so my, when I'm employed, 
with money to blow I buy form-fitting feminine and on-trend clothes um, yeah I'd say that because it reflects my personality my personality and my dating intentions <laughs> it reflects my personality and makes me feel attractive right okay why do you want to appear on dress to impress I think it might be a fun way to meet new people. Yeah. Tell us one interesting fact about yourself. Um, <laughs> Do you have knowledge of it? Do you have tattoos? What makes me unique? Oh, what makes me... I don't feel that I'm unique. <laughs> I'm just like every other person. Oh, God. What makes me unique for the show? Oh. Gosh. This is a weird question. Do you have a hobby? I say social media is my hobby and the journey I'm on after the journey I'm on after a traumatic life event might mm, be endearing shall I say social media is my hobby and my journey and the journey I'm on after a traumatic life event might be endearing okay Have you applied to be on any of yes? Take me out. Set uh, in September twenty. Was it twenty seventy? September twenty sixteen. I applied for Take Me Out in 2016 and got to first audition stage. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. No, not continue later. I just pressed the wrong bloody button. Need help. No, this cannot be happening. Sign in, okay, I've got to sign in. Okay. Yeah. Already. 
registered. Oh my God, this cannot be happening. Brilliant. Okay, so I've got there. Right, unemployed. Da, 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 da. Next. Stage three. Do you have any medical conditions? Um, no. Do you have any county court? No. No. And driving offences? No, I don't even drive. Right. Is there any other information we should be made aware of concerning your application? No. Availability. Oh God! Please state that you're available between. Oh, what's that? What's that about? When the program is originally scheduled to be filmed. Well. <laughs> Video, so it's a two to three minute video of yourself shows off your personality character style. You could describe your personality. Oh god! <laughs> oh my gosh! I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Upload a photo. Oh god! Do I have a photo? I don't have a good, a decent photo. How? How? Let's see. Is that a decent photo? Yeah. God, good to do it like that. And take a f choose a photo library. I do have another video. There we go. Choose. And it says a video. Oh God! Excuse me while I do this funny pause. So this is the final part of what happened when I applied for dress to impress today with you guys on this vlog. And um, so it asked me for two photos and a video, and I uploaded a video that I took when I had an intention of finding someone on uh, eHarmony. So um, hopefully that will express my personality when I'm feeling good. Ah. <laughs> And then um, two photos of me, full view, in my current state. <laughs> Need to hit the gym, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I'm a little bit overweight at the moment, so it's, I'm not happy with the photos, but it's who I am at the moment. So, maybe I'll get an e- Right, so, yeah, I had two emails after that from dress to impress your register uh, within a, your registration to dress to impress series 3 has been finished and then you have successfully uh, your you've successfully registered to apply for dress to impress and that's that so i'm just going to move that on to the right folder <sighs> so got a little bit distracted with an email with my current housing situation so we'll deal with that on finance friday so yes that's all applied <laughs> i put my best foot forward in the, the most uh doable way i guess in these circumstances so I'm on this journey, so why should I stop? Since the dating app didn't really go well, didn't meet anyone. Um, 
we're in lockdown, so who knows? <laughs> this might be a chance to meet that right person. So I guess the final reality date, that reality date in TV show is going to be next week, Wednesday. And who knows if I will have a response from them or not. Who knows? So I'm signing out, saying goodbye guys and have a fantastic day and I'll see you on Friday.